Hello everyone. So today we get to read Miss Spider's Sunny Patch Friends, Owl Fly Away by David Kirk. Everybody in Sunny Patch was so excited. The flying aces were in town. Dragon couldn't wait to see Rocky and Roxy, the leaders of the troop. High in the sky, the aces flew forwards and backwards. They did figure eights and loop-de-loops. Buggin, gasped Dragon. I wish I could do that. Rocky landed on a nearby tree stump. Howdy, kids. Who wants to get a taste of the sky? All the little bugs raised their arms. The aces invited Bounce to come for a ride. Be careful with Bounce, Dragon exclaimed. We've been through everything together. We're best bug buddies for life. You should join our school, Rocky said. With a little practice, you could be a flying ace in no time. Really? Me? cried Dragon. That night, Dragon told his mom that he wanted to join the flying aces. I don't think so, Dragon, said Miss Spider. You're a part of our family now. You can fly away some other day. Dragon sighed and slumped off to bed. Dragon couldn't sleep. Are you leaving us? asked the tearful Bounce. I thought we were best bug buddies for life. We are, said Dragon, but I'm a dragonfly. I should be with other dragonflies. The next day, Miss Spider and Holly discussed what Dragon had said. Maybe he's right, sighed Miss Spider. Maybe he does belong with other dragonflies. Though they didn't want to let Dragon go, they decided to let him follow his dreams. The Sunny Patch kids gathered around the hollow tree to say goodbye to Dragon. Bounced was the saddest of all. Don't forget your best bug buddy, he called. Miss Spider and Holly gave Dragon a final squeeze. We love you, Dragon, they said. Dragon squeezed them back. I love you too, he said. Then, looking at the clouds, he took off to meet Rocky and Roxy. Dragon practiced his moves with the aces. He learned to fly in formation, make beautiful figure eights, and a perfect loop-de-loop. -loop. But he didn't feel happy. He couldn't stop thinking about his family. At the Dribbly Dell, Squirt, Shimmer, and Bounce were trying to start a soccer berry game. But without their star player Dragon, it wasn't much fun. Suddenly, they heard the sound of wings. Dragon's back, yelled Bounce. But Dragon, began Holly, you wanted to be with other dragonflies. I thought I did, replied Dragon. They may be dragonflies, but you're my family. Everyone cheered. The happy family was together again. Well, I hope everyone enjoyed that story, and as always, I'm really glad you're here, and we'll talk to you soon.